We are avid readers of Silicon Prairie News here at Betablocks, so let's do a deeper dive for those less familiar into what they are and how they help Midwest startups. What is it that they do uh, for entrepreneurs and for Kansas City? Well, Silicon Prairie News is um, basically the tech crunch of the Midwest. So if you're on Silicon Prairie News, you're someone important. You need to read about these comp companies. So it's basically the place where all of the up and coming companies are at and also mid-level to high level companies in the Midwest. It's basically, it basically covers everything in the Midwest in terms of entrepreneurship. You can get uh, new jobs, new opportunities. You can learn about the new companies that are coming up. You can um, you know, get, stay up to date with the latest ideas in the Midwest and what everybody is doing. Um, you know, they have uh, different uh, events like Big Omaha, Big Kansas, uh, events like that that brings everyone together in one place, you know. And I think uh, a lot of entrepreneurs get a lot of value from it. Bragging about ourselves isn't necessarily one of our strong suits, and Silicon Prairie News does a really good job of, of not just going with whatever the biggest story is, but finding people who really um, are doing good things and are uh, making a, a big difference for the community and, and, and growing a business that's got the, that either is impactful or has the real potential to be an, an impactful business in our region and highlighting those efforts and making those, those people visible. Unique thing about a Silicon Prairie News event like a big Omaha or big Kansas City is that they, they encourage their speakers to stick around for the entire event. Um, to make themselves available to that you don't have to stand in a line of 50 or 100 people to talk to somebody who speaks at a big a big omaha you can just go up to them at the after party and and have a conversation with folks and that that provides a huge amount of access to people that aren't normally um you know it, making kansas city or omaha um, one of their regular destinations when they first came to kansas city a few years ago they threw a big launch party uh, they periodically will do just uh, meetups for just anybody in the community to come meet with them, with uh, other members of the community, just so that they can, you know, keep in touch and, and have conversations. We can have conversations with each other. They can talk to startups, all that stuff. Um, they do fun things like every year they do awards for startups and people in the startup community all over the Midwest. Uh, so they, they get really engaged. They're a really great sounding board for startups, but they do so much more for the community also. Mm -hmm.